In a groundbreaking discovery, scientists have identified at least 150,000 tons of water frost atop Mars' tallest volcanoes, challenging prior assumptions that such conditions were impossible on the planet. This revelation came from high-resolution images taken by the European Space Agency's Trace Gas Orbiter TGO, which observed a fine dusting of frost on the summits of volcanoes in Mars' Tharsis region, home to the largest mountains in the solar system, which are up to three times the height of Mount Everest. The frost, equivalent to the volume of 60 Olympic swimming pools, forms during the colder months and condenses along the mountain peaks each night, evaporating under the morning sun. This phenomenon defies the belief that Mars' equatorial region, due to its mix of sunlight and thin atmosphere, was too warm during the day for frost to form. Lead study author Adomas Valentinez, a postdoctoral fellow at Brown University, highlighted the uniqueness of this discovery, contrasting it with Earth's frosty peaks which are more easily explained by daily temperature variations. Welcome, I hope you enjoy then subscribe and like. Published in the journal Nature Geoscience on June 10, the study's findings offer critical insights for modeling the presence of water on Mars, which is vital for future human exploration. The research involved analyzing 30,000 images captured by the TGO, revealing an ethereal blue frost forming due to unique Martian microclimates where cool air ascends to the volcano's peaks. Valentinas suggested that this frost might be a remnant of an ancient Martian climate cycle, indicating that precipitation, and possibly snowfall, occurred on these volcanoes in the past. This discovery opens new avenues for studying Mars' environment, particularly ancient hydrothermal pools that could have supported microbial life. Future missions, including NASA's proposed sample return mission, could bring samples from these vents to Earth for detailed analysis. Moreover, the Perseverance rover, which has been exploring Jezero Crater since 2021, might have already collected evidence of ancient life in Mars dust. NASA's initial plan for a retrieval mission was slated for 2026, but due to budget constraints, this has been postponed to 2040. To expedite the mission, NASA is seeking proposals from private companies. Valentinas, driven by the idea of a second genesis, or the existence of life beyond Earth, is eager to continue his research on the Martian environment. This discovery of frost atop Mars' tallest volcanoes not only challenges existing theories but also enhances our understanding of the Red Planet, potentially aiding future human colonization and exploration efforts. Thanks for watching.